Hey! It's Jo. So for today's video, we are going to talk about the trendiest phase for plastic surgery in 2020. Beauty, as they say, is in the eye of the beholder. But it seems that female K-pop idols currently have the most desirable features. According to Korea Boo, a recent episode of Video Star featured South Korean plastic surgeon Kim Jong Myo, who revealed the top three female stars who were the trendiest among his clientele when it came to getting work done on their faces. As we all know, plastic surgery is common in South Korea. They are proud of it. It's okay sa kanila. Even high school students, yung mga hinihingi nilang gift sa parents nila when they graduate high school is mo the most common is double eyelid surgery. Kasi nga, most of Koreans are, are monolids. And I don't have anything against it. But personally, masakit yon. <laughs> Pero, sobrang ganda ng mga surgery sa kanila. So, when Dr. Kim jong Myung was asked about the matter by the show's host, the famous plastic surgeon, who is the older brother of hunky singer and actor Kim jong Kook, if you're not familiar with Kim jong Kook, I'll insert a photo. And if I find a photo of Dr. Kim jong Myung, insert din natin yan. Dr. Kim jong Myung related that clients would show him photos of female South Korean actresses like Han Yesul, I'll insert a photo, Kim Tae-hee, we've already talked about Kim Tae-hee in my previous video, dun sa K-pop lookalike, I'll insert an eye button on the screen, and Shin Min Ah in the past. So Shin Min Ah, kilala na natin yan. So Dr. Kim added that actress Song Hye Kyo, was the top choice among his previous clients for the ideal look of beauty. Sobrang ganda naman kasi talaga ni Song Hekyo. Diba? Kaloka. But the trend has changed. And nowadays, Dr. Kim shared the names of K-pop idols who are the most mentioned by his clients who see him for consultations. On the third spot is Jenny of Red Hot Group Blackpink. Dr. Kim said that Jenny had a feminine mystic to her look that was most desirable to his clients. In fairness, ang ganda-ganda naman talaga ni Jenny. Very, ano ba tawag dito? Maamo. Super amo ng mukha. Beautiful talaga. Parang mysterious. Parang ganyan. And the second spot is Yuna of the long-running K-pop outfit Girls' Generation. So, Yuna was also a popular choice for those who were seeking out a look that portrayed the traditional South Korean beauty. I'm not really sure kung Yuna had undergone any surgery to her face, pero yung features niya talagang super Korean na Korean. So, di ba yung features niya super Korean pa din. Yung double eyelid niya is very, very subtle. And super simple lang. Simple lang yung beauty niya, pero elegant. Super elegant. Yuna is not just a pretty face. She recently won an award at the 4th International Film Festival and Awards in Macau. Or the IFFAM. Alongside with our own Bea Alonzo. Super Payat ni Yuna, as in skinny legend. Diba? Hindi lang siya maganda. She's also a great actress. So, our first, first on the list, the trendiest features sought out by most belonged to Irene of Red Velvet. I'll insert a photo. The gorgeous K pop idol was said to possess well defined, quote unquote, facial features 
that made her stand out from the rest. This is according to Dr. Kim Ha, the plastic surgeon. Sobrang ganda naman talaga ni Irene. I mean, Irene is born Bay Ju Hyun. She's also a rapper, a host, and a model. She's actually the leader of Red Velvet. She's 28, pero pag nakita mo yung mga pictures niya, sobrang ganda ng skin. Parang ang bata-bata pa niya. Hindi mo iisipin na papunta na siyang, papunta na siyang 30s. Ang ganda ng skin nila. Wala masyadong wrinkles. As in, ang ganda. Sana all. Diba? Siguro kung makikita natin siya ng personal, mas mukha pa siyang way younger than her age. Another fact about Irene, from May 2015 to June 2016, Irene hosted the music show Music Bank with actor Park Bogum, Bogumi. They both gained attention for their chemistry as well as singing and hosting skills. The press called them one of the best partnerships in the show's history. Magaling din sila mag-host, in fairness, pati si Bogum, si Park Bogum. So that's it for today's video, guys. But I want to ask you, if ever you'll be offered to go under the knife or to have a surgery, plastic surgery, all expense paid, kahit na anong gusto nyong ipagawa, go lang sa South Korea, who would you choose? Ako? Kahit na malaki yung chance na I won't because I'm afraid, Song Hekyo. Song Hekyo will be my ideal look. She would be my peg, kumbaga. Kasi sobrang ganda niya. Ang amo ng face, parang ang bait, 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 bait. <laughs> ang daming bait nun. At saka, super ganda niya talaga. Although, parang hindi ko naman gagawin kasi nga, I'm scared. Because there are news na, alam mo yun? mga nagpapa surgery na hindi nakakalabas ng operating room alive so medyo nakakatakot if you are familiar with Shex Diary ano siya makeup and beauty vlogger din dito sa YouTube she had um, an eyelid surgery and rhinoplasty in Korea hindi ko alam kung all expense paid yon or kung may binayaran siya, I forgot. Pero pinanood yung video niya. Nakakatuwa kasi maasikaso yung mga nurse. At saka parang may doctor find, I'm not really sure, dun sa clinic na kung saan she even flew, diba? I, I mean, nagstay yata siya in Korea for a month yata para mag-heal and syempre after ng operation, meron pa yung check-up and titingnan kung if she's happy doon sa kanila basan. And maganda naman. Maganda yung pagkakagawa ng eyes niya. I will insert a photo of her before and after ni Shek para makita nyo yung sobrang uh, enhancement. Kung alam mo yun, ang ganda. Ang ganda nung pagkaka-opera sa kanya. Although, nakakatawa yung video. Kasi, pag talagang under anesthesia ka, di ba, nagiging madaldal, hindi mo alam yung sinasabi mo, nakakaloka. May kasama naman siyang isang assistant, which is, I believe, kailangan. Kasi nga, paano ka makakagalaw ng comfortably, di ba, kung uh, ang dami mong cast sa mukha. Siyempre, hindi ka pa pwedeng maligo. And, mer- after ng operation, kailangan pa ng massage something and meron silang pinapainom na tea para matanggal yung pamamaga. So, yeah. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. Please like and subscribe. I hope to see you on my next video. God bless you all. Bye!